Um, can you make routes and routes and scenarios? Yeah, I mean, Matt does things. If people put stuff up to workshop, um, then it will um, then uh, and then let me know the details. Then uh, I can take a look at it with a view to streaming it. Pretty much everything that I run, to be honest, is either stuff that comes in the box, or is um, uh, or is um, community created on Steam Workshop. Right, Hanover, hop on off, uh, track 13. Rail driver's working. Horn's working. And can it be fictional? Well, of course it can. As long as, I mean, as long as it's, you know, of a sensible quality, then uh, there's nothing more fictional than that at all. Yes, you're already misconstruction sim. <laughs> My mic has gone all toppy. How do you mean, Katie? I don't know what toppy means. Right. Signal's white, so we can go. What do you mean the mic is not on, bus master? It's definitely on. Oh, the PZB went on once you get onto. Uh, Uh, Simon, um, yeah, just let me know as soon as possible. Yellow, can't see exactly which way we're going. The mid is a bit wonky, but I've not done anything to the microphone. The mid quality has gone to the hot. Just reset the link, uh, see if that's any better. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. How is the microphone? So my microphone's gone, and uh, that puts a dampener on the events. Why are we doing a night scenario? Um, it actually was. <laughs> right, coming into track 13 now. It does sound like I'm underwater. What? So is, is the audio coming through for everybody else all right? Turn down the in-game volume. Well, we've got the in-game volume turned down quite a way. Right. How does it sound now? I've just turned the volume right up on the microphone. I'm guessing I'm peeking out like crazy now. Jimmer's MTL, thanks for the follow, much appreciated. I want to do a tutorial on um, making assets from Blender. Uh, I don't know at this point. Hanover Nordstark. I'm going to assume that that's in front of me, because honestly, it is in front of me. Good. What's the thing in the top left corner? Train won't move. <laughs> what have I done? There we go. Last signal was a yellow. Oh, we're already going to be late. Rob is key, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. 
How many followers? It should say at the bottom of the screen. Oh, at the bottom of the screen, how many followers there are. Right, hang on. Got to get me pedal back. Right. Uh, Forty with a sixty after it. Oh, I didn't acknowledge it. TSMS Boone, thank you for the follow. Just getting out of the habit of these scenarios now. I need to get do more German scenarios so I don't keep getting out of the habit of them. Okay, so apparently, the, apparently none of my rail drivers set up to work on this thing. Uh, we'll, we'll stop using that. I use the keyboard. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Rumble, rumble. It's off to a massively fantastic start. Did the pedal, did this thing, nothing worked. Smacking button didn't work. Apparently, I need, yeah, I need to use that one. Right. Green light coming up. Now we're going too fast. These white 101s have been quite popular in this scenario. Off to a great start. <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's it. Press the enter key and see if it's working. I obviously need to do a bit of setup on this loco to get the rail driver working properly. Train, not loco. But if you haven't already noticed it, at the bottom of the stream now, at the under, in the window, you should have tested this. I know if I test every last thing to every art, every art, well, it's it take me about five hours to get ready for each scenario. To some extent, I kind of just need to know it's just going to work. <laughs> Never mind, most things do. Hanover Nordstadt. Yeah, take clips, use the new clip feature. My tractor was doing fine. It was the uh, truck in construction simulator that was uh, that's never going to quite be the same again. Con -sim, uh, construction sim, Dave had a blast with it. Actually, really enjoyed it. Got the doors open. Still not done a barrel roll in a truck. No, I'm not as quite as good as you, Simon. Not quite as good as you. Mind you, to be fair, you haven't done a barrel roll either. You got halfway out. You got about a quarter of the way, and then the truck stopped moving. <laughs> <laughs> right, Lederberg. So I understand. Remember rightly, we're on an airport run here. Go me remembering to acknowledge the PZB. 
No, there's no transcoding tonight. Sad but true. through here where's the airport so if you come out of Hamburg let me show you um, you come out of Hamburg round and I think the airport is this one yeah this is the Flughafen so it's round and up to there Uh, Francois, it really, how many viewers you've got is only part of the equation um, for transcoding. It's also down to how busy the rest of the network is. So if if, if Twitch is not very busy, then you then the, the number of viewers required to get transcoding. In fact, it's not even viewers if you think about it, because you start streaming, technically you've got nobody, no viewers at all. Um, so really it's down to... Uh, Um, you know, almost blind luck. You get the fifth time in a row. Yeah, we get it quite frequently now, Rubku. It's on and off, though. It's, I think it's almost down to the luck of the draw at this point. Right, coming into Lederberg. <clears throat> Transcoding it basically allows you to uh, watch the stream at different quality settings than the way I'm broadcasting them. Nice, nice bit of AI. Twitch partnership. Uh, I'm still waiting to hear. I haven't heard a bean out of them, to be honest. It's been dead since I, I haven't I haven't even had the email. When you apply for Twitch partnership, you normally get an automated email back saying, thanks for applying for Twitch partnership. I haven't even had that, so not sure what's going on there. Paul CJ got a new PC up and running. Excellent. You sure you sent it to the right email? You, do you fill in a web form, Dave? It's not done over email. You fill in a form on the website, and when I filled in the form on the website, it said they give you your application. So I'm going to take that to mean yes. Fuel used? How have they set this career scenario up? This is an electric train. Why is there a fuel used penalty? The timings on this are quite good. We're actually managing to catch up from the earlier um, late running. 
when will you do the NJCL scenario pack? Uh, I might, I'll might. i do one scenario from that tomorrow, I think. Same as before with the scenario packs. I'm not going to run all of them. I'm going to run uh, one scenario just so you can sort of see roughly what what you get in the pack. If I run it all, then you don't need to, you don't need to buy it, do you? Right, can someone count three minutes for me, please? Are they measuring how many kilowatt hours? Are you? Well, that's the only thing I can think of. There isn't anything else they could be measuring, really. Nice. There we go. Fuel used alarm alert again. What's going on with that? Yeah, all well, the room is darker now, Daniel. That's why the green screen's working. Maybe the units run out of tea. I don't know. Langenhagen. Does that mean if you have regenerative breaks, you can get a positive score? I see that—that that sounds reasonable. I haven't re done the redone version of Donna yet. No, that's actually I think up for tomorrow. <coughs> Langenhagen, what we got next? Fedmarkt and Hanover Flughafen. Nilde. What's the three minutes for? Um, when you make cup of tea, you should have it in the tea leaves for three minutes. Otherwise you overbrew it. You don't want to do that. That's bad. <laughs> Problem with watching the stream was at work, keeps getting in the way. Yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> Ad Lali, thank you for the follow, much appreciated. Oh, I just acknowledged, I ended that. Oh, that's going to cause me some problems in a minute. Do I put milk and sugar in my cuppa? No! No, it's green tea, you don't put milk and sugar in it.
What right, time will it start tomorrow? Well, I'm aiming for 2 p.m., but it might be a little bit later. It depends. Um, it, yeah, I knew that would happen. <laughs> it's because I ignore I released from monitoring. And uh, if you release from monitoring, and I shouldn't have done that because the signal wasn't green. And when I hit the 500 hertz magnet, it's gone. What? Hey, no, that doesn't compute. Brakes. But meanwhile, I'm going to open the doors. <laughs> So there's at least a couple of carriages we'll get out, get there get there. Will the first racing car be pink? Yeah. I haven't actually tried I haven't done much with Forza Apex yet. But yes, I shall be doing pink cars, obviously. This is what happens when you don't do a German scenario for a while. We well, don't do it because a lot of German scenarios don't actually cause too much sort of pain and stress on the uh, on the PZB. White me Forza Six recommend controller on the wheel. Well, the, um, Windows Ten Forza uh, Forza Six Apex you can't actually use a controller anyway. Sorry, you can't use a wheel. Oh, that's what we're waiting for. BR-68 or the BR-24? That's tough. I don't know how I would rate which one I prefer. If, okay, I'll go with the BR-68 as being possibly my favourite one of the two. Um, but it's there's this much in it, and they're both really good. When will the train sim portion start? Well, it'd be earlier because I'm going to do six hours of train sim. Um, but it's not going to be much earlier, is it, really? It's Forza 6, a demo or beta. It's a full game. It's free on Windows, on the Windows Store. On Windows 10. You have to have Windows 10 to make it work. Right, we're in monitoring 500 hertz, so we've got 25 kmh limit. Boo. We have a green light. I can't do anything until we're out of restricted monitoring. Sorry, out of 500 hertz. Yeah, Forza 6 Apex is free. It's a beta, yes, Amarillan, but it's gonna, it's, it will be. It's not, it's not beta and then going to paid. It, it is free. It's the full game. Daniel Cohen of America, go into the Windows 10 store. Moggy, uh, Forza 6 normally is on Xbox One, but it's now on, um, you can get Forza 6 Apex on the Windows 10 store. And today, uh, tomorrow, is it today? Today is the last day you get the chance to upgrade for Windows 10 for free. It's a contains in-app purchases. So the way that the in-app purchases work is that um, if you want to get ahead of the game and buy access to cars that you haven't earned you can do that so it's essentially you pay to cheat bluntly um, if you want to play the game the way you'd normally do by winning races and earning credits and then buying cars then I believe that works at the same pace it does normally in a Forza game What I would say is, those of you that haven't upgraded yet, you're almost certainly going to regret it next year when you find you have to pay for the upgrade. Because DirectX 12 only works, uh, will only come ever, it will only ever come on Windows 10. They're not doing DirectX 12 any, on anything else. Alright, coming around to Hanover Flughafen now.
I don't, uh, I don't know about uh, tomorrow is the final day. Really? Because that would mean it's a, a year and a day. Because the first day of the upgrade was July 29th in the morning. So if it's free again tomorrow, that means that it is actually a year and a day. Okay, which it might be. I assumed it was um, up until essentially um, uh, tomorrow, um, over the midnight boundary. Yeah, I've heard a number of people say that they feel that there's bugs in Windows 10, but it's the most, by far the most stable Windows operating system I've used in a long time. Never had any issues with it, and it's faster. It's the whole machines just um, seem a bit slicker. So no, I've had I've got nothing but good things to say about Windows 10. Everything I've tried to use on it has worked. And there we go, that's Hanu with Luke Harfen. Uh, Dave, it works on my uh, nine-year-old uh, nine laptop as well. That's the first time, in fact, that machine's been on Windows 10 now for a year. I have a love-hate relationship with Microsoft Edge, I must admit. It's, it's a lot faster than Chrome, but it really doesn't work very well with Google Apps, which I guess I shouldn't be too surprised about. Um, however, I use Google Apps quite a lot, so... Will the new train sim work on Windows 7? Um, again, I can't answer compatibility stuff yet. Does Windows 10 improve game performance? I think I've not seen any categorical um, yes or no on that one. I've heard a number of people say, oh, wow, it makes a big difference. And other people say it makes no difference at all. Um, but, um, yeah. But anyway, so that scenario was S1 Hanover Part 1 with, by B.W. Kempton um, on the Hamburg Hanover line. Right, now, it's your turn. It's your turn. Right, let me just uh, switch to this. I'll get it switched over to the game and I'll fire that up. Uh, the revamp is tomorrow.